Hello everyone and welcome back to the episode of Bronze to Glory, the road to Division 1 series where we try to use the packs, bronze packs, to try to go up to Division 1. Division 1. Is there an echo in here? Is that really going to be the intro? So last time we played, and by last time I mean for me it was like five minutes ago, uh, we played two games. We drew the first one. It was a great game. Actually, that guy was a really good player. So luckily we drew, we drew in like the 90th minute Eduardo da Silva got the equalizer, he got both goals in that game, and then we won 3-0 in the second game. It was a much easier match because he got sent off, well, his one front got sent off, so he was down to 10 men for the majority of the game. So now, in Division 7, we're on 14 points. We have gained the promotion, we have four games remaining to get three points to get the title. Now, let's start off by opening some bronze packs. I'm at 158,000 coin balance, might go down to like 150,000 in this pack session. Second pack, what are we gonna get? It's a rare center mid, uh, it's a Brazilian, Amora, he has Look, pretty good looking stats. What league is that though? Because I do need it's a Saudi league. You know what? I was look, I was trying to get a, I was gonna build a Saudi league, but I don't really have enough players yet. I have better players in different leagues, so the Saudi league just needs that one special player. Also, someone I really need is a Cam who's Portuguese in the Portuguese league because that would help link two squads together very nicely. All right, Harry Kane, who are you going to show me? It's a goalkeeper. Don't really need him. Novo. Portuguese. I already have a lot of Portuguese goalkeepers. Marcial on the cover. He was in the pack. Center back. American. Wall. Well, I like Wall, but we already have him. Alright, what are we going to get in this pack? Only a couple more packs remaining. It's a right back from Fishland. Quiles. Fishland. Very nice team. Alright, probably three more packs. This is the third to final pack. It's a goalkeeper. Syria. Berni. I uh, don't have a Serie A squad. I do have a Calcio B squad, which is almost finished. I just need a couple more players. All right, and the final pack, which is going to take us right about to 150,000 coins, and it is a rare. It's a right mid, and it's uh, Samuel Swin. Does he have five-star skills? Maybe. I think he has at least four, but he's. Uh, I think he's on loan from West Ham, the four-star skiller. That is pretty good English, too. I'm going to look to use him, but I don't know if I can at the moment. All right, for the first game, I've built a new squad featuring the Japanese League. Oh, well, only really one player from the Japanese League. It's Nakagawa, 5'1", the shortest player in FIFA with 89 pace. His uh, acceleration, balance, and agility are very high, though, so I'm hoping for a lot from that. This Japanese cam, Kobayashi, he's a 68 silver, but he plays in the, uh, the Netherlands, so air to busy, but I didn't really have any good center mids, center defensive mids to link him with, so he only gets the Japanese link, but they're still both on 7 chem. Then I have some Mexican boys over here. The midfield looks very strong in the Mexican league. Two non-rare silvers combining with Salas. Then over here is some French connections, De La Place. We have Perenel, Pajeri, Pajari. Uh, he's not the greatest left back, but it'll do. Then we have Wall, Jimenez, and in goal, Gonzalez. As always, boys, if you're enjoying this series, I'd love the support. The support you give me is always amazing, but just drop a like, drop a comment. I hope you're having a great day. All right, so this game kind of has some importance because if I win, I get promoted, but it's not the worst thing in the world. This guy has almost an entirely, well, it's Chilean up front. Uh, he has 100 chem, 82 overall, four and a half star. That informed striker Sanchez looks very dangerous. Oriano, he has Vargas at left winger, uh, Vidal, and then I can't remember that center mid who plays in the Bundesliga, but he has Renato Sanchez, a Brazilian, or a Portuguese player, I mean. All right, boys, Brazilians at the back as well. Nakagawa, I'm expecting 3,000 hat tricks from you. Look how short he is. Oh, he doesn't start off well with that pass. Here's Orozco. De La Place. Plays it for De La Torre. De La Torre still has it. Come on, De La Torre. Play it down for Kobayashi. Kobayashi. Holds on to it well. Back for Kobayashi. Come on. Eat the hot dogs, bro. <laughs> Eat the hot dogs. Here is Orozco. Play for Nakagawa. Nakagawa! Oh, what a save by Berlano. Nakagawa's movements off the ball. Very impressive so far. Right, we're going to play it to Nakagawa, who's actually shorter than the uh, corner flag, which is kind of hilarious. Kobayashi into Salas. Hold it. Nakagawa's making a run. Here's Nakagawa with the pace. Can he just whip it in? Oh, gets, he gets another corner. Nakagawa is dangerous. She let to play it now. Salas is away. Go, Salas. Bang it for me. What was that tackle by Jonathan Ta? He just killed me. Oh, what? Oriano. It's Vidal. No. No, Arturo has the angle to shoot. I really thought that was going to go in. There's Kobayashi. One more. It's Nakagawa. Nakagawa with a chance. That was terrible. What? 
because his movement off the ball is so good. But then that finish, I didn't. I wanted him to hit it with the right foot. So at the break, I feel like I've been pretty dominant. I really should have scored with Nakagawa. It should be 1-0. That's the only chance that I've had where I really should have scored. But then on offense for him, he just has Alexis Sanchez striker version, in form version, so it's always dangerous. I won't make any substitutions just yet, but if I get to the 60th minute, haven't scored anything, I'm going to take off Orozco for Da Silva. Kobayashi played through. Nakagawa's away. Nakagawa's away. Go Nakagawa. Don't get caught. You have 89 pace, but... Penalty? You just, you can't do that to a little boy. Nakagawa, get the ball. Play it now, De La Place. De La Place inside, one more. Oh. Play it now, Kobayashi. Nakagawa's away, go Nakagawa. He makes such great runs, but then he gets caught by Naldo so easily. Paranel, through the middle, Nakagawa, go. Go Nakagawa, come on. This is your time to shine. Nakagawa, come on, go Nakagawa. What was that finish? That was so bad. How he's getting into such great positions, but it's like if you put me on the field and I tried to score. One, two, Nakagawa. Play it now. Nakagawa, go. Nakagawa, go. Go with Jonathan. the pace. Keep going. That's a foul, Jonathan Tayo. Little mug. Okay, I'm going to take off Kobayashi and put on Ince if I have him. Yes, there's Ince. I'm going to take off Orozco, put on Da Silva. Now we have this free kick. Now I'm going to lay it off, hopefully, for Ince. It's just gonna come onto the pitch and just bang it in. His first touch of the game, and he just bangs it in. That's what that's the ins factor, boys, on the left foot from that angle. That's a goal. Just absolutely well worked. What a strike. That's his first touch. Who needs a warm-up when you can do that? Who needs a warm-up when you're the English Messi? Oh no, he hit the post. Gonzalez, get up. Get up, bro. Right, boys, I really don't want to throw this away in the final seconds when I've been in total control of this game. Here's Eduardo. Eduardo comes onto the pitch. The substitutes are making the impact. It's Eduardo to bang it from that distance, boys. The substitutes just came on with their left feet of gold and just made the difference. This is what he does. He just runs at you. You can try your little slide tackle, tac slide tackle tactics. It's not going to work. What a hit. That's ridiculous. There's the final whistle, boys. 2-0. We get the victory, we get the title in Division 7. Da Silva comes on, plays like 20 minutes, gets the man of the match 8.4. Inns also gets an 8.2. Both of them, the substitutes, have the goals, assists, De La Torre and Salas. And that, like I said, gives us the title. 17 points, 3 games remaining, 5 wins, 2 draws, no losses here in Division 7. Alright, for the next game, I'm gonna go with a team with Da Silva where we just start him. We start him at Inns. It's the team that I ended last episode with. And just everyone's pretty good in this team. The only thing that I'm really worried about is Chowdhury. I'm gonna look at his. Does he have? Yeah, he has a. He only has medium attacking work rates, but it plays like he has high low because he always finds himself playing like a cam, which I'm worried about in these upper divisions. In Division Six, I need a center defensive mid who's just gonna stay back and help protect the center backs. All right, the first opponent in Division Six is coming up with a five-star, 84 overall, 99 cam team. He has Giovinco at striker with no cam around him. Baca, Everbenega, Nangalan, uh, he has, uh, what is that guy's name? I can't think of it, uh, but the, the center defensive mid, he has Jean Mario, uh, he has Alexandro, Manolas, what is that? Oh, Gary Medell, why couldn't I think of that? All right, boys, let's just get off to another start. We can't underestimate anyone here in Division 6. Here's Rhodes, play it now. Da Silva is away early. Eduardo Da Silva is doing so well. Can he bang it from that shot? Oh my goodness, boys! His left foot is so good. He's better than a lot of gold players I've used. He not only did he outpace Manolas, he outmuscled Manolas, and then on the left foot, what is that shot? That's like something you would see Luis Suarez do. Oh no, no, no. Wow, that was really well worked. One all, they immediately replied and they dabbed on me. Just a couple of passes absolutely cut open my defense. Miazga, you gotta play better than that, bro. Jackson, Chowdhury. Like I said, Chowdhury's playing like a cam for some reason. Look, Chowdhury is the furthest person forward. I don't understand why. Play it now for Ince. Ince. Da Silva. Da Silva. Plays it through for Bree. The fullback. Bree. Cut it on the left foot. Bree puts it away. Da Silva gets the assist. I hope so. Bree, the fullback, actually gets into a good position, gets it on the left foot, and just curls it around the keeper. No, boys, don't let them instantly reply. This guy's offense is so good going forward. No, no, we didn't get it off Gary Medell. Good block. Oh, wait, what? Penalty. What? 
What did I just do? I thought I just had an amazing block. What? They didn't even show me the replay. Okay, now we gotta come up big. Damon, the goalkeeper. Where's Chewbacca gonna go? I have no idea where he's gonna go. I just gotta hope, hope he's going... Nope, I guessed wrong. It's 2-all. All right, boys, it seems like this is gonna be a very offensive game. We gotta just hope that we can play defense or be the last team to score. Oh, Vanega. Damn, boys. I just don't know what to do defensively. How am I down 3-2? 20, 21 minutes in, five goals already scored. 1-2. Da Silva, play it now. Ince, your way. Go, Ince. Run, Ince. Take it in stride. Can you get it on your left foot? On the left foot of glory. Oh, what a block. Eduardo Silva's. Eduardo. What was that? That was on your left foot. No, why are you playing him on side? Miazga, what are you doing, bro? Wake up, Miazga, what a save. But Miazga, you were just standing there. All right, at halftime, I don't know what's going on, but the controller is like not letting me control it right now. So it's just passing it when I'm not really pressing any buttons to pass. Also defensively, I don't know what I'm doing wrong. I think Chowdhury's just playing like a cam for some reason. It's three goals for him, two for me. Nick Randall's go, come on, on the break. Play it now. Who is it? It's Rhodes. Rhodes gets by one. Play it through for Ince. Ince, can you outpace? No, you can't outpace Monolas. Oh, but Monolas, what is he doing at the back? Monolas gives it away to Ince. Monolas has made two mistakes, and Ince and Da Silva have pounced on it. Three all now. What an exciting match. I don't really know what Monolas is doing right there, but a fake shot. He gets tackled by Ince on the right foot. Not the greatest finish, but it went in. Ince. Here's Rhodes. Rhodes has been exceptionally quiet. Play it down for Eduardo. Make that run. It's the fullback who's making the run, McGuire. Now hold it. I don't want to get hit on the counterattack. Eduardo for Ince. Ince. Hold him off. Play for Chowdhury. 1-2. Another 1-2. Play. Rhodes. Rhodes, extend the leg. No, why didn't you just slide to do anything you could to get that in? Chowdhury for Eduardo. Eduardo turns his man. Still Eduardo. On the left foot. Ah, oh, I just struck it too hard. Here's Eduardo. Eduardo turns his man. Keep going. Keep running with it, Eduardo. Keep going, Eduardo. Eduardo, this is your time to shine. This is your time to shine, Eduardo. On the left foot. On the left foot. Oh, the center back. Oh my gosh, Eduardo is so good. What a mazy run. Eduardo, one, two. Back for Eduardo. Eduardo, hold him off. Keep running. Run out of them, Eduardo. 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 He's done it before, boys. He's done it before. He's done it before, boys. And he does it again in the 90th minute in extra time. At the end of the game, who steps up? The best player I've used in FIFA 17 is Eduardo. Diego Costa lookalike. Even though he's older than Diego Costa, but he still looks younger than him. Oh, it's amazing. What a, he's just a legend, boys. He's just a legend. He's already a legend. There's the final whistle, final kick of the game. He just has a knack for it. I mean, I don't know how he doesn't get man of the match. Bree, my right back, gets man of the match. Da Silva, two goals, Ince a goal. Bree, one goal, assist, one to Da Silva, one to Bree. So that win gets us off to a good start here in Division 6. One win, no losses, no draws, nine games remaining. We need 13 more points for the promotion. And if we get 16 more, we get the title. That's where I'm going to end this episode of Bronze Glory. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm just, I'm finding my groove. I'm really starting to enjoy this game because I've gotten the players that I need. Eduardo Da Silva is the player that I needed. I hope you guys are enjoying it as well. If you did, please drop a like on the video, subscribe if you're new, comment, share with your friends. Hope to see you next time, and as always, don't forget to spare your pets.